Do you want to save on skincare products? Of course you do and this is why in this video I'm gonna share with you three tips that they are gonna help you save a lot on your favorite skincare products. I thought this would be a perfect video since we are approaching Black Friday and who doesn't like a good deal? I know for I always get a lot of satisfaction when I can have a good deal so I'm gonna share with you my top three strategies to save money on skincare. My name is Luisa, I am a cosmetic chemist on a mission to help you look and feel your best. So let's start with the first tip. The first tip has to do with credit cards and it's this, take advantage of uh, credit cards. So uh, if you have a Capital One, uh, American Express or even Chase credit card, it doesn't really matter because uh, I've seen this with all three. I'm not sure that other credit cards have it, but I'm gonna leave you the link to apply to this three that I'm sure they have. So if you go in the portal uh, where your uh, whole account and profile uh, information are, you're gonna see that sometimes they have uh, offers on many skincare brands. For example, I've seen Paula's Choice 20% off just because you pay with your credit card and that specific credit card instead of using another one. I've seen uh, also uh, other uh, brands like La Roche-Posay, I've seen Yves Saint Laurent, I've seen Fresh, I've seen uh, um, Clinique. I've really seen a lot of good uh, quality uh, brands, both for men and women. So this is something that I really recommend. This tactic is even better now that we are on Black Friday because uh, many stores are already making doing sales and you can get an extra 10-20% off on top of the sale price. So this uh, is a very powerful strategy that allows me to save a lot of money on skincare. Moving on, the second strategy has a lot uh, to do with how uh, you use the products. So uh, there are certain products that are simply not meant to be used uh, every day and they are not meant to use in the whole um, face area. For example, if let's say you have acne in this, uh, this is very common, the most common area, and the jaw area, if you have acne over there uh, only, you're not gonna use the products all over your face. You're only gonna use it, the acne, you're only gonna use this acne treatment where you actually have acne. So there's this uh, uh, Paula's Choice product, for example, the 2% BHA, which is salicylic acid, that I only use uh, uh, a week, a month. And uh, uh, this is why, uh, this is because uh, I have uh, like acne in this area, or not really acne, but just some zits um, in this, uh, I cannot say Z, sorry, um, in this uh, area. So when that happens, uh, I apply the, uh, the toner only on that area. This has allowed me to like buy the toner and uh, has last, is lasting me more than six months because again, um, I don't apply it on the whole face, I only apply where, when and where I need it. Of course, you cannot apply this uh, concept to other products as well, for example, anti-aging products. Those need to be applied all over our uh, face for best um, results. As far as the where, I want to point, I want to bring uh, up a very important point is that, is that just because a product says uh, body doesn't mean they cannot be applied on the face. So for example, if you have a body cream that you really like, um, you can use it as moisturizer for the face uh, as well. We cannot do vice versa because you know we are talking about saving money and doing vice versa would be, um, would be like wasting money. So 
but definitely a cream like uh, uh, for example the Nivea cream or the La Roche-Posay cream all those body cream that are unscented um, can be you and our pure moisturizer can be definitely used on the face as well and that will help you save money on skincare too the third tip that i want to give you is about uh, what to buy okay if you want to save money you need to start educating yourself on what products are really uh, worth the price the cost and what aren't so i want you to stop uh, reading the marketing claims and focus more on learning about ingredients okay so for example there's this product that has a uh, a huge uh, i'm not gonna mention the product but it has a huge uh, watermelon on um, the packaging and uh, there is kind of like a marketing claim about uh, the presence of watermelon in the skincare products now we know that there is no scientific evidence that watermelon extract is actually gonna do anything for your skin so you might be tempted to buy the product because you like the packaging and of course you like watermelon eh? as we all do but uh, that product most likely is not gonna worth the price if you are on a budget uh, you cannot afford to spend money on those you be able to buy maybe in the future who knows so focus on what is really uh, essential meaning the the usual ingredients that i always sell that are proven really proven to work uh, let me repeat them one more time so something like vitamin c retinol niacinamide hyaluronic acid um, squalene uh, botanical oils um, you want to really um, put all the money in uh, into these uh, products because those are the ones they are gonna uh, really make your skin look uh, better and lastly remember that you are not obligated to buy a full size uh, product meaning that for example sephora they have a whole shelf with uh, one ounce or two ounces travel set product so before you buy the regular size see if you can find um, a smaller size of the product i know for a fact that i have and this has helped me a lot saving uh, money if you really like a product but it doesn't come in the travel size my recommendation is uh, uh, if it it is from a reputable brand a brand that you know you can trust because of its transparency history traditions uh, positive reviews at that point uh, invest in the product otherwise if it's a brand that you are not really sure that uh, it can be trusted you're not really sure of the quality of the product trust me sometimes it's better not to buy uh, anything or uh, just switch uh, brands so there are so many skincare uh, products on the market that I have no doubts that uh, you can find uh, something that works uh, for you. This is it for this video. I hope it was useful. I, I hope you're going to get a lot of great deals <laughs> at Black Friday and I'll see you in the next video.